Spot is a quadruped mobile robot designed to navigate autonomously. One of its most interesting applications in the manufacturing world is its ability to inspect hundreds of assets. In this simulation during IMTS, Spot is on a thermal anomaly detection mission. Equipped with a PTZ camera with a 30x optical zoom and a thermal camera, the robot is making sure this motor is not overheating. You can see that, uh, that motor sitting on top of the cabinet right there. So Spot is stopping and taking a picture of that, right? Taking a thermal scan, looking for a potential problem in that motor. Basically, Spot is taking a scan of that image and then after it completes its, the rest of its mission, it will go sit back on the dock and upload all that data. That data stream is what we're seeing over here, right? So you're able to see over time how the temperature is changing in that motor and if it has a problem. So you can set parameters to say, okay, if it exceeds a certain temperature, I want you to send an alarm to let the maintenance team know, hey, we've got to go do something and fix this. Everything starts with programming the robot. You first have to take Spot through the mission once and show it the assets to scan. Once all the data is collected, Spot returns to its dock and uploads that data. It will then be able to repeat the same mission over again autonomously. Spot is ideal for facilities that have lots and lots of those types of motors, compressors, pumps. So facilities that have you know hundreds of assets, that's a great use case for a robot because it's not feasible to have a person walk around and check all of those assets as much as it is you know to have a robot do it. Spot walks at about 3.5 miles per hour, the equivalent of human walking speed. The robot has a built-in system that allows it to avoid obstacles and people. However, Spot cannot make any preventative decisions like stopping an overheating motor. Inside Spot is what we call athletic intelligence. So Spot can make minor decisions mostly related to its mobility. If it starts to lose its balance and stumble, it can decide where to place its feet to avoid you know, falling over. The other thing that Spot has built in is a feature called obstacle avoidance. So on each side of the robot, you'll see cameras on the back, both sides, and on the front. And basically, as the robot approaches you know, an object, right, a railing, a cabinet, a person, it can tell how far it is away. And so if you were to place something in the way of the robot, it wouldn't run into it. It would navigate around it and then continue on its mission. What it can't do is decide, I'm gonna go get you a cup of coffee, or I'm gonna go take a picture of that machine, or I'm gonna go off on my own and you know explore. It can't do that. It's following a very narrow set of, of programming parameters. Boston Dynamics sells the basic robot. Add-ons such as thermal scanners, cameras, and litter systems are available depending on the type of application. Spot can even be equipped with a robotic arm like this one for fulfilling manipulation tasks like opening a door or turning a valve or a gear. 